And I would never. You do it all the time. I don't know what you're talking about. Say that what you're saying doesn't matter? I mean, you apply it by shushing me, yeah. Oh, I, I shushed you once. Oh, no. Yes, I shushed you once. That was one once. instance of you shushing me. <laughs> Say it again? Shh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I thought. Just try the head. <laughs> Please, into the mic next time. Shh. Or like poison. It's okay. It's okay. It's not okay. <laughs> He gets that from you. You saying it's his, okay does not... I know. His... No, no, no. We won't talk about this anymore yeah. because it's upsetting somebody. It's fine. Yeah. We're just not... Yeah. We'll move on. I'm like, it's okay to talk about things that make you uncomfortable <laughs> so that you can work through that. Yes. I'm trying to correct myself because I can see what's happening. And it's really funny because it's like I'm talking to myself. And it's like, oh, God, stop, stop. Make Done it, stop. it again. <laughs> <laughs> Please, make it stop. Two, two wasn't enough for you. You had to go triple down. I had to go Ranking. ruin another kid. It's just in my jeans to hey, ruin man, all the if kids. If you weren't here to ruin us, we would have done it ourselves. So. Really? You think so? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I don't know. You may not have. Have you, you may have lived have you met my brain? really happy lives. Yeah, but th your brain is because I made it. Ha! <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I still have your genes, regardless oh, of whether or not you exist. Dang. I didn't think of that. <laughs> why Why do you think I was so adamant of, like, maybe not passing on these genetics? Maybe not doing that to another human no. being. Yeah, that's seriously a consideration. Because it's like, I don't really have the best genetics to go around reproducing, so... Ouch. Are you kidding me? That hurt. What? Between, no, actually me and, hurt. Actually. between me and JD, our genetics are terrible. He's had cancer. You have a, 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 an autoimmune disease. Your mother has an autoimmune disease. I don't want to get that. It's only bad someone. when it's bad. It's bad whenever you're like, I know this is a thing, but I'm going to willingly give it to you. Like, what? Okay, so you, because I you, did not willingly. You didn't know about it whenever you, no. you had us, right? No. But like, if you had known that that could be something that you could pass on to your children? Uh, Would you have right, put more right. consideration into it? Well... That's the difference between being 21 and 30. Being 20. Well, I'm just saying. I was 20 when I got... I know. 20 was... Whatever. Yeah. That's the difference yeah, between yeah, being okay. 20 and your 30s. Yeah. It's being like... Able to decide and not you can see long into the future of what your children will be, and you're like, oh shit. <laughs> children aren't just children. They can inherit shit. Ah. Uh, like depression and diseases. I mean, it's not your fault. Your mom gave it to you, so you can blame her. Let's blame. Let's blame your mom. Wait, no. You got to go further up the chain. Well, I know, but I don't. I don't know that. Can we go so. all the way up the chain and just blame? But it's more fun to just blame your mom. All your ancestors. Yeah. It how, is more fun to blame your ancestors. You know, when you look at what our ancestors went through it's pretty impressive that we're alive that they actually survived to have our ancestors mm. it's pretty impressive because it would have been more impressive if they're the ones that found the oil <laughs> i'm just saying <laughs> Agreed. What, they're too good to dig some holes they were too busy farming and trying to make a living, like yeah. feed their family. They didn't. They didn't get the lucky farm with the oil. What the hell? No. That sounds about what right. What kind of land run is that? <laughs> that's that's about our yeah. That's about right. We call that generational luck. Oh, we have none. God. That's funny. Okay. <laughs> Cute man. Yeah, it's also that, but that's because I'm a cynic and I don't enjoy. Mind. I, I think it's cool. Because I don't. Actually, I think I do. I just am so used to people feeling right. that I don't. Exactly. <clears throat> Did you just be excited? Can I, with I'll me? just remind you I went on two 20 hour car rides. So I think I had a lot of time to <laughs> self reflect. You're supposed to be talking to your right husband there. and like. 
-hmm. work through your oh, okay. uh, marriage issues. Mm -mm. Yes, that's what you're you supposed to do. To them. No, that's you what you're supposed to do. Issues. Twenty hour mm -hmm. car ride. Imagine talking to the <laughs> to the same person. Do you exist? All we learned is that JD doesn't like loud enough music and he like has bad taste. All I ever learned on these trips. Oh. He likes that soft one music. I just can't. Like when you say soft boy, like uh, boy bands. Oh, like okay. punk music. Oh, like old. Like, I was like, wait. He said to me on the last uh -oh. day of our trip, he was like. Can you put something on like uh like tool or metallic? I was like Ew. Oh, you know, That's not that. soft. Okay, well. So. It I don't for one thing, tool <laughs> sucks. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna willingly listen to tool. The only time you listen to tool is when it's on the radio and you have That's an actual band tool? Yes. Okay. They have like one good song. Uh they they made like their latest song that got really popular is a nine minute instrumental. Oh my it was God. just the same boring. It wasn't even interesting. It was the same boring, like. No instrumental is interesting for nine minutes. No. For one minute. I I'll no. take a minute and 30 seconds. I'll uh -uh. take a guitar solo, which is like 30 seconds. Ooh. But like an instrumental that's just boring. Not, it wasn't even interesting. Like there was, it was like not actual instruments, you know, like they made on the computer or something. Uh. I don't know. That could be wrong. It could have been instruments, but it just was yeah, boring. Okay. If I don't know what instruments you're playing, then I don't think it's interesting. <laughs> you're doing it wrong. Because he's done with you. I don't know. I do. I agree with that. Yeah. You would And they're kind of douchebags from what I can tell. Uh, they were like, they were like being mean to some indie band on TikTok the other day. What the and they're like, imagine being like this band and like you're punching down on a band that is like well, that's just small. gross why wouldn't you lift each other up i mean we can all we all know that rock stars are probably not the best people on the planet <laughs> let's be fair <laughs> they are not role that's, models that's like every time they're like can you believe this rock star has a cocaine addict oh. ad addict and i'm like yes have you met rock stars yeah. like every hello rock star everywhere and the, or they'll be like, can you believe this rock band that was a Christian band was actually terrible? I'm like, yeah. yeah. They're rock stars. <laughs> what are you talking and about? Not, I'm sure there's some Christian good Christian doesn't mean that you're... Immune to being bad. I mean... You, just because, just you because have, you're Christian doesn't mean that you're perfect. Because no Christian is perfect. Right, just because you have religion doesn't you're mean you're fallible. a good person. Right. Like, it's ridiculous. Anyway, I hate when people funny. do that. They're like, oh, but you're a Christian. And I'm like, and? That doesn't mean I'm perfect. There was one person on this earth that was perfect, and I was not that person. Yeah, it's me. It's right here. <laughs> <laughs> Have you met my father and my daughter? <laughs> There's two perfect people. That's it. <laughs> hey, let me introduce you to them. <laughs> no. Oh, right. We don't talk. Oh. Lost my head for a minute. You crazy. Problem we have. I like that you're like, I don't want your dogs to eat them. I'm like, my dog's been there the whole time. <laughs> Talking about getting them. No, home. I was thinking, like, knocking, knocking them, them over. over. Yes. There, her tail I does... I forget I exist. Her tail is, like, a full <laughs> loop, so it does tend to, like, wag and grab and pull. <laughs> Which is a problem. But no, I exist. Yeah, you so... are you are the <laughs> Okay. Figure this out. It's bigger than I thought. Bless you. I'm so sorry. That was so loud. <laughs> the bowl is bigger than I thought, right? Yeah, it's huge. So it's huge. Is this part of your bowl? Yes. I just found it. I don't know I where. I, oh, right yeah. there. Yeah. But I'm also, trying to figure out where. It's like small bits of the yeah. white. I would have sorted them in here too. It's just. I didn't see it. So that's fine. Well, you know what I realized? Because whenever we were sorting the black and white puzzle, 
I was like, how do we miss those smidges? Because sometimes we oh. have like this small smidge of black. And I realized it's because when you pick up a piece, you hold it. Yeah. So you're hiding yes, a fourth you're hiding of the piece. Part of it. Yeah. It's not ineptitude, it's just dumb. Dude, we didn't even talk about our lunch. Oh, yeah, lunch. So Kelsey how was, cook. How was the seasoning? Because I threw it in, actually was really good. Threw in a bunch of extra shit. I don't yeah, know if you no. noticed that. I did notice it's, it's fine. Well, it's actually really good. When they say salt and pepper, what they mean is add seasoning. So, I am a very... When you get a recipe, you follow the recipe. For baking? No. I follow the recipe. Because to me, you're not going to know if you like it or not unless you follow the recipe. And then you make changes after that. But you can't add seasoning after it's cooked. Well, I understand I'm saying the next time, then you can add yeah. what you want. But the first time, I always do it exactly how it says so that I know if I like it that way. Well, then you're doing it. Yeah. I, I, I guess I understand. <laughs> <laughs> they were wrong. It should have had yes. parsley and basil. Yes. I mean, it goes well with the spinach. We, we understand. <laughs> but so, we had gnocchi. Noki? How do you say that? Gnocchi. That's how I say it. I think that's bad. Um, it's just how it always sounds to me. Gnocchi and, and uh, spinach. Gnocchi, spinach, and chicken, and tits. And like a butter sauce. It was really good. I don't know that that's something I would make again, like personally. I would probably make that sauce again because it's really would easy. Because it was just butter. I didn't really like the garlic, but I didn't put very much in it. I didn't put all the garlic in it. Um, butter, seasoning, uh, cream cheese, which is interesting. Yeah. Um, I think that's what thickened you could, it. You could substitute, instead of the cream cheese, you could put either like sour cream, I think would add a little bit more body and flavor mm -hmm. to it, or you could put cheese, like you could put actual cheese mm, in it. Yeah. Um, which I think would be better if you added just like some mozzarella and melt that down into it. Um, but it was butter, cream cheese, uh, seasoning, and then we just put, uh, water. I think we put water in it. Yeah, there was a third cup of water in the sauce. And then spinach. I mean, no. And then I added, I added basil, parsley, onion powder, <laughs> and then salt and some pepper. Okay. Just because if you're going to say it's good, I might as well say everything yeah. that was actually in it. It was good. I'm not going to make it again, but it was good. You don't like it? It was good. Did you like the gnocchi, though? Eh, I mean, yeah, but it's not just... Not more than actual pasta? Yeah. I'd rather have pasta. Hmm. What? I like it. I like it more than pasta. Oh, okay. But I just like that because it's almost like I, you know I was talking about like chicken dumpling yeah. soup is all it's almost that same consistency. Yeah, it it's is. Just a little bit heavier because it's potatoes. Right. Instead of flour. No, it is. You're right. But yeah, I mean, honestly, that would be good if you made a chicken dumpling soup and instead you put gnocchi in it. Okay, I could that see would that. Be yes, try. I could see that. Stop looking at the eyes. I need to take this and get away from it because this is not, this is going to be a not treasure healthy. hunt. Yeah. Not healthy? Not healthy. <laughs> I should instead use the box that I was getting. Oh. Because we'll have the pieces in there. I'm just going to turn back over here. Okay. So I also pulled here. out some interesting pieces. I like interesting pieces. I, they called my name and I set them on the edge where they will probably fall. I was going to say, we don't have an edge to oh, work on. on this edge. <laughs> That's why I'm not yeah. worried. I, usually I, you get upset if I cover the pieces. This time I don't give a shit. I don't have much choice. Okay. I didn't say anything to you about covering. I know, it has bubbles. Oh. Why are you bringing our past into this? Why can't we just be in right now, in the now? Yeah, just don't ever talk about your past ever right. again. Mm -hmm. It is. Not in the slightest. <laughs> He's so serious. Just chill. Go with the boat. Roll. I would Just say roll. bad parenting, honestly. 
I don't parent anymore. Not you. I yeah, do? maybe that's part of the problem. You just gave up. You want me to parent you? You just <gasps> walked away. It, this is decide. on camera that she wants me to parent her still. Mm -hmm. It's on camera. What's on camera? We have visual evidence. Oh, do we? Okay, well, we have evidence. I'm in control of all said evidence. <laughs> fair, fair. <laughs> Please announce for the, oh, the camera Lord. what I need to delete. Okay. You know what? Fuck these pieces and bowls. Karen's a bitch. Uh, That's what I'm gonna say about that. No. <laughs> like just me. No. She could have just have a nice gradient, like sectioned off puzzle. No. no. She had to put pieces and bowls, and they're so hard. No. I think it's just because I'm doing it upside down, but it's so hard. Like they just are dumb. I'm gonna just do a puzzle about like a plant. Yes. So you don't like the this this the way she did the puzzle. Got it. Got it. Okay. The video was nice and all, but doing the puzzle sucks. <laughs> we were excited and all, but. <laughs> <laughs> That's not to be our sound. There's a song that opens in the same intro. <laughs> oh, I hate that. Uh, Vanilla Ice had a song that opened the exact same way as another song. Yeah. And of course, they went to court, and well, yeah. he proved that it it had an extra beat. Yeah, and I was like, "Oh, come on!" But yeah, I mean, uh, there's a lot of music where it's the same. Hmm. They're both snoring now. <laughs> Lazy days. Honestly, whenever they're both sleeping and like snoring next to me, that'll make me fat. Oh, yeah. That, that is the key yeah. is to fall asleep day as much. Yeah, when Corey falls asleep and he's snoring, it's like, ah. Oh. Just take a wee little nap. Yeah. <laughs> It was whenever I used to put him down for naps, it was hard to get up sometimes. I'd be like, okay, I'm just gonna Dude, lay here. I used to, because I worked the day here, I used to um, do my homework at nap time. It's the only time I had <laughs> to do it. It was so hard. I'm not gonna lie, it was so hard to sit there and read a boring textbook yeah. in the dark. While the kids are snoring. While they're sleepy toddlers. Because <laughs> okay. your brain, it isn't like, okay, time to like, yeah, to learn something new today. Your brain's <laughs> like, time to also take a nap because it's when the children are sleeping. Yes. It's like, I can't, that's illegal. <laughs> Biology wants me to sleep. My <laughs> Pink and yellow, eh? Everywhere. All over the puzzle. Pink and yellow. Yeah. What the hell? Is she gonna pick a couple more colors? She likes, um, what's it called? Bright colors, and it's in our aesthetic. I, mm -hmm. you know, this puzzle is good, though. It's not... Yeah, it's not bad. It's not shit like you were saying before you streamed. <gasps> Girl, like, this is the oh, worst horrible puzzle person. I've ever fucking touched in my life. And I regret it. Oh my god. <laughs> never. Never. Ever. Could you imagine me saying, well, I'm sure I've said bad things, but... Like, totally... Bragging somebody like that. I don't know, it depends on how bad that is. You could. I might have. I don't know. I could be mean. That sound? Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, I did such a good job, I guess. You did do I a good didn't. job. Considering there's no. 3,000 pieces and like they're all kind of the same colors. Yeah, yeah, I did a good job. And I don't know that I could have done better by 
doing more keep time. going. Yeah. I mean, because there's only so much you can do mm. without putting pieces together. Yeah, exactly. So, and there's I was running the risk yeah. of putting pieces together. Well, you did put pieces together. Okay, but... <laughs> Let's not pretend. It wasn't that many. <laughs> I just, just wanted to see if I had all the edge pieces. And I did not. So that's whenever I decided, okay, do a second sort. And I did. And okay. I found the you piece. just a little bit? Show me, did you do the whole edge? Because you already did it once. I didn't do the whole edge. <laughs> I couldn't. There was it was not possible. I had boxes all over the table, remember? <laughs> yeah, I had them all I had put them all away and I thought, no, I can get them all out and let her see what I did, because I did a lot. I, know, I, I did I was like, great. Okay, I don't know where we're gonna do the puzzle, but alright. <laughs> Just happy. Good. I was excited because I how much I actually got done. Is oh sorry, I didn't know that I would be able to get that much done. I knew, I knew you were capable. I knew I was capable. I just didn't know if I would. I also be knew able you wouldn't get. quit until it was done. Yeah, I'm kind of bad like that, but it's a good quality too. In some cases. Are you uh, doing uh, your okay. other game today? Oh. Just making sure. I didn't know what time it was, but I was just making sure. <gasps> no. Well, it's not. Uh, sure. Do we still have a five? Or we still have a Is six? it five? I don't know. Now you got me confused. It's been a while. I really don't. don't know. <laughs> Stop at six today. How about that? Okay. I don't know if that's right, but I'm not done. I did tell my other daughter she had to get out of my house by six, so. There you go. <laughs> no, I knew she needed a little reprieve from. When you have a sick husband, I don't know how many people have had six hu sick husbands before, but not it's that. not. That sick, just like a cold. Yeah. 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 A lot, apparently, the last couple of years, I would imagine. Yeah. Or guys, I should say guys. Because uh, they're just big babies. I'm sorry, but they're big babies. Love you, honey. <laughs> if you're watching, I'm so, I don't mean you. Because <laughs> you would never. Jimmy's like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, I mean you. <laughs> You know, there's two times of the day that I watch TikTok. One is when I'm in the carpool lane for Corey. And he called me while I was sitting there. I was like, man, come on. <laughs> this is me time. Oh, yeah, I didn't watch, like, any TikTok. It's like, oh. while we were gone. Because, like, you can't just, like, scroll through TikTok. What? Where you're, like, in a crowd of people. Oh, right, you know? like, right. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I'm, that's why I only watch TikTok twice a day. Cause yeah. when I'm with your dad, I don't. Cause like normal TikTok. social media, you can just like scroll and read. Yeah, read and like normal forget. Yeah. Social Older social media, but like TikTok, yeah. you can because you can't hear it. And nobody yeah. uses subtitles because they're fucking ableist. I see that. Put subtitles first. Man, it's ableist. I'm gonna say anything. I try to. I, I generally try to put uh, subtitles on everything. Oh, yeah. Because That's good. It's, it did move on to you. But I heard on YouTube her that it was like it cost money to to put subtitles. Um, well, yeah, you have to get a translator for YouTube. Yeah. Because they don't have like an auto translate. Right. And I guess the auto translate is really bad. <sighs> Because one of the YouTubers I used to watch, um, she, uh, her brother is actually, has a cochlear. Mm -hmm. And um, 
she was talking to him one day and he was like, well, I can, but I can't, sometimes it doesn't translate correctly. And she goes, what do you mean? So he had to explain to her that, you know, yes, there is translation, but it's not always correct. Yeah, obviously. And she didn't realize that. She thought that since YouTube translated, then it translated correctly. I mean, it's a robot trying to interpret human right. speech into a different language. It's not going to be and, I mean, perfect. And, I mean... Even, and I know I'm bringing this up, but with Ancestry, it it has a computer that reads the papers. Yeah. But they're not always correct. Yeah, I mean, the technology's not quite there yet. No. It will be one day, but... No, it's not. Not today. It is not. Honestly, if anything, the last year is has been the biggest advancement in that kind of technology, so... Give it a couple of years, it'll be there. <laughs> yeah, true. I had a realization when I was watching Critical Role the other day, because they went to a new city and it was a gambling city. Yeah. And because Matt Mercer is such a good DM, he created fake gambling games okay. in this world. Right? Because you don't want to copy other gambling games. Right. One of them was basically Blackjack, and then another one was something else. But, you know, so you want your players to play the games, so right. he created rule, like rolling dice rules for these games. One of them is a card game, but like you use dice to do it. Uh -huh. Anyway, it was really cool. And I realized I watched like two hours of these people playing gambling in a make-believe world <laughs> with make-believe money and like the first time they went no dude it was like crazy because like the first game they played he won the table and it was like 600 gold and then the second time they played like six of them played and they all hit a 21 in blackjack wow all but one of them hit a 21 and it was crazy because like Dallas was like that's here, impressive. here i'm gonna break the the <laughs> i'm gonna break the streak because four of them had rolled a 21 yeah and he's like i'm gonna break it and he rolled a 21 <laughs> it was crazy <laughs> Ultimately, they didn't win very much money because they all won, but still, it was That's, crazy because it's yeah. like, what's the likelihood of <laughs> five out of six players rolling 21 and not the, uh, not the, uh, what's it called, the person that orients the game? The dealer. Yeah, not the dealer. It was crazy. But That's pretty cool, I was just though, like, what a, just sitting here watch people play make believe <laughs> gambling. <laughs> I'm really excited to get the next episode though because apparently there's an orgy involved. That not a real orgy. <laughs> not, not a real, real orgy. Not a real fake orgy. Like, they fake in their make believe game. They fake an orgy to get out of a battle. I, think. I love when you get uncomfortable. It's not uncomfortable. It's, it's just like it doesn't make sense. Whenever you say it's not a real orgy because it's not it's a make believe game, but it's not a real orgy in the make believe game either. <laughs> that makes sense. Sometimes I forget whenever I'm watching that the stuff that's happening isn't, like, actually Real. on screen. <laughs> well, because, like, you're watching a show and you can see all the stuff, but, like, sometimes I forget when I'm watching Critical Role that it's not playing out on the screen. It feels like it. It's oh, like, okay, because like you're so into what they're saying. Yeah. that You, you can okay. see what's happening. It's like yeah. reading a book, you know? Yeah. You can, you're so into the game that you feel like... Uh, you can see it. Yeah. Interesting. It's funny. It's a funny thing our brain does sometimes. Yes. Well, and like whenever they come out with movies and stuff and you've read the book, you have a picture of that character oh. in your head and they don't always do oh. the character like what you have in your head. Honestly. And that's annoying. Unless the, the author is like constantly reinforcing what a character looks like. Yeah. Most, most authors give like a brief description of what your char the right. character looks like in the beginning of the book. Right. And that's it. You just know. I don't. I give up. I'm like, no, this is what I've decided they look like. <laughs> I don't give a shit what your actual... Oh, you think he's blonde? He's not blonde. Just trust me. <laughs> I I've decided what this character looks like. You don't get a say in this. <laughs> it's so funny because like they'll be like, she's redhead. I'm like, oh yeah, it's not in my head though. <laughs> okay, now I don't because usually they they do a good job of describing. It depends. It depends on the book. I've read a lot of books. Um, yes.